Hello everybody and welcome back to our Cleveland Browns franchise, our player franchise, here in Madden 17. Today we kick off the preseason of 2017 against the Philadelphia Eagles. It is preseason and, uh, well, it's sure to be a fun one. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we take on the Eagles, the Colts the Broncos, and the Jaguars. Today, of course, we'll be showing you the preseason highlights to our second year in the NFL. Hopefully, he's a starter, uh, but quickly, it does not look like that's going to be the case because at home against Philadelphia, they absolutely tear us a new one. 30-14, to 14, the score ends up being. So, one week down, three weeks to go. Let's see if we can get it back against the Denver Broncos without Peyton Manning. This one to Corey Coleman. Reason no highlights in game one? Well, there were none. I just did not pass the ball, and if I did, it was for 20 yards. So, no point in showing it. Right there, though, Corey Coleman, first down. And then Terrell Pryor, senior, for a first down catch. Second and two now. This one off to Patton. He is a new guy. That's Quentin Patton in our receiving core. He gets a first down for us. And then from the six, handoff to Crowell. And Crowell crushes into the end zone. The Browns find themselves up on the Denver Broncos. It is preseason, but it's the Browns. This one to Terrell Pryor. It's good injured player. That's Denver's Akeem Tlaib. Thought it was Terrell Pryor at first. That would have made me cry, let's be honest. He's one of our only... Three good guys in that receiving core. This one, we slide to end the first quarter. We get a first down. It's nine yards. And then we hand it off to our reserves. They do a heck of a job. And look at the lead grow. 27-3. 33. And when it was all said and done, the final would be Cleveland 33. Denver 25. Denver came back in the last about four minutes. But we beat Denver, and uh, again, I know it's preseason, but we are Cleveland, and we beat Denver, so that has to show for something. So week three now against the Jacksonville Jaguars, once again at home, and then we travel to Lucas Oil Stadium to play the Colts. We're looking to get two wins in a row, something I don't think Cleveland's done in about three or four years, uh, probably, or truthfully, I don't know, but... I'm just going to go out on a limb and say that. That one, we find our guy, Troll Pryor, one more time. First catch for him in the first quarter, 20 yards. Guess what? That's all we would go for. Two uh, passes that you would see complete. End the quarter, three for four. And one more time, the reserves do their job. 24-7 over Jacksonville. 31-7 over Jacksonville. 34, 37 over Jacksonville. And again, when it's all said and done, Cleveland. The reserves look better than the starters. 37 to 7 win over the Jaguars. A 33-25 win over the Broncos. That's back-to-back -back game, ladies and gentlemen. The Browns have posted 30 plus. But it would all come to a screeching halt in Lucas Oil Stadium in Indianapolis, Indiana. Playing the Colts. Well, it's not going to be a fun one. Quickly down 17 nothing, but we do try and make the comeback 17-7. However, it was all for naught. We get a field goal. That's all we would get. We lose this game 17-10. But hey, 2-2 two two in the preseason and scoring 30-plus points. I know our reserves did most of the work. I would definitely give that preseason for the Browns a, a B for a lowest grade possible. A B. So with that said, here's a little, here's a little, uh, not really timely cut in a Madden 18th long shot, the new player career, but we're doing a player career. I thought that was the perfect ad when it popped up, so there you go. Go check it out if you're on Madden 17. Uh, guys, we are going to advance next week, and we start our season by taking on the team we just lost to. The Indianapolis Colts. So, uh, hopefully we still are starter when this all advances. We'll check in about 10 seconds here. 
But uh, preseason was good. I gave the Browns a B grade overall on a grade of A to F, obviously. Let me know what you thought. Next time out, we'll set our season goal. We'll do the weekly training, and then we'll head to Lucas Oil Stadium for the second week in a row. However, this time, it means something. Week 1 of the 2017 NFL season, and we're still a starter, will be next week. I hope you guys enjoy.